Durham's largest public housing community, McDougal Terrace, could be next, uh, could be closing, I should say, in just the next couple of years. And new tonight, we are hearing from people who live there about everything that's happening. We've been reporting on a lot of the issues at the complex there for quite some time now. In fact, just a couple of years ago, tenants were forced out of their homes uh, because, and into hotels, I should say, because of carbon monoxide. Now, those issues stem from stoves and furnaces and hot water heaters. The Department of Housing and Urban Development has now given housing authority leaders two options here. The first is to come up with a plan to fix all the problems. The second option, if you can't do that, tear the complex down. People who live there were quite shocked to hear all of this. Honestly, I was shocked. I was really shocked because I didn't see it coming. Um, I was blindsided. Like, it's, it's still a shock to me. Eventually, we knew this time was coming. We knew this time was going to come, and we didn't know it was coming this soon, but we knew it was coming eventually because of the conditions of MacDougall. Uh, Durham Housing Authority, the CEO, Anthony Scott, says that there's going to be a process that they will go through before making any final decisions about this. He tells us that tenants will be involved in that process. We do expect to learn a lot more about the decision during a news conference tomorrow morning at 11 o'clock.